Hi friends, you are watching Gate Helpline and in this video we will see question number 23 from Gate Exam 16 question paper. Friends, please hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon to get all the latest updates from our channel regarding Gate Exam. So friends, question number 23 is, a database of research articles in a journal uses the following schema and the schema consists of volume, number, start page, end page, title, year and price. The primary key is volume, number, start page, end page and the following functional dependencies exist in the schema and the following given three are the functional dependencies. The database is redesigned and use the following schema and below given are the two different schemas. Now the question is which is the weakest form that the new database satisfies but the old does not and the options are A 1NF B 2NF C 3NF and D B C N F. So friends now we'll see explanation to this question. So friends please watch this video till end so that you can get the concept behind this question that why in gate this type of questions are asked. So first of all we will start with first normal form. A relational schema is in first normal form if the domains of all the attributes are atomic. First normal form is categorized by the property of atomicity means only one value for each tuple or there must not be any multi-valued attribute. And one thing to be noted is if super key or candidate key closure determines all the attributes in a relation then it is one normal form which simply means that if with the help of candidate key we are able to get all the attributes of the schema then that particular schema is known as in first normal form. And now we will see what is second normal form. Second normal form is categorized by the property of functional dependency. A relation is in second normal form if it's in first normal form and every non-key attribute is fully and functionally dependent on the primary key which simply means which you can check with the help of if RHS contains non-prime attributes and LHS contains a part of candidate key or primary key then 2NF is violated hence there is a partial dependency which is violation of 2NF so it simply means that if the RHS contains non-prime attributes non-prime attributes are those which are not a part of candidate key and LHS contains all the attributes which are part of candidate key or primary key in this kind of situation partial dependency is there and if partial dependency is there it is violation of 2NF which simply means it is not in 2NF and if partial dependency is not there then we can say that the particular schema follows or is in second normal form. So friends now we will see the schema. In this question we are given with this schema as volume, number, start page, end page, title, year and price as attributes and the primary key given is volume, number, start page and end page and the following functional dependencies exist in the schema and these are the three functional dependencies and the database is redesigned to use the following schema and these are the later schemas which are designed. So first of all we will check the older relation for first normal form and then we will check whether it fulfills the second normal form or not. So for first normal form we know that if the primary key or the candidate key is able to get all the attributes in the schema or the closure of primary key is able to get all the attributes of the schema then the following functional dependencies are in first normal form. So here we first of all calculate the closure of primary key. So the closure of primary key from the first FD will give title and with the help of second with the help of volume and number which are present in primary key we can get year and from third FD we can get volume number start page end page will give us price. So the closure of this primary key will have all the attributes of the schema. So this evaluates that older schema is in first normal form. After first normal form we need to check for second normal form and as we have discussed about second normal form that 
it must not have partial dependency and for partial dependency what we need to check is the LHS will not have any part of primary key or candidate key and the RHS will not have any non-prime attributes but here in these all three FDs you can see that the LHS is having the part of primary key that is volume, number, start page and end page and the RHS is having non-prime attributes as title, year and price. So this one is following the partial dependency. So as this one is obeying partial dependency, so it's violating the laws of second normal form. So now we can see that old relation has functional dependency as partial dependency. So it does not follow second normal form. So now we need to check for the new schema that is the database is redesigned and use the following schema and these are the two schemas and if you check these two schemas are made up of these functional dependencies as the first one is having volume, number, start page, end page, title and price which gives the functional dependency first and third and the next one is volume, number and year which is the middle functional dependency. So from here first of all we need to check whether it follows first normal form or not. It is in first normal form that is volume, number, start page and end page will be primary key for first schema and with the help of these four attributes we can easily get title with the help of first functional dependency and price with the help of third functional dependency and in the next schema we have volume, number and year. So volume and number will be primary key for this one and volume and number gives year with the help of this middle or the second functional dependency. So it's obvious that it's following the normal form and we can directly say that this particular two schemas are in BCNF because this particular candidate key or super key is able to achieve or able to get the entire attributes and which is true for all both these schemas. So here you can see that first and third dependency goes to the first table and middle dependency goes to the second table. In both only keys are determinate. So it's in BCNF and there is no partial dependency in the new relation. So friends, 2NF is the weakest normal form that the new database satisfies but the old one does not because the old one is not following 2NF but the new one is following BCNF. So 2NF is the weakest normal form. So friends, as per our discussion, answer to this question is option B that is 2NF is the weakest normal form that the new database satisfies but the old one does not. So friends, thanks for watching our video. Please like, subscribe our channel and share our videos to appreciate our work. If you have any doubt or question, please comment below and keep watching our channel for videos like this.